Hello. I am back from vacation. That's it. Four days in Arizona. But it's uh it's good to be back home. And getting on with whatever's gonna happen here. Oh hey. What is this? It's a thing. You said you wanted work? This is work. Uh-huh. And who's the guy? You'll see. Yes? Hi. <laughs> oh. Hello. We're looking what the heck's going on outside. with his wrist? For fuck's sake, just let him in. Right this way, gentlemen. <laughs> Patricia, get us something to drink, would you? Quickly! Hey, good to see you again, Michael. <laughs> Likewise. Uh, this is my friend Trevor. Uh, sit down. Who's this guy? Sit, sit. I can't remember. So what did you tell him about me, about Martin Madrazo? Martin's an old friend of mine, Trevor. The truth. Martin is a terrifying psychopath who tried to kill me. Exactly. <laughs> but some people, they no longer fear me as much as they used to. People who wear clothes to me. Uh, my cousin, uh, you met in my call. <laughs> well, apparently, he's thinking about testifying against oh. me. So I have him killed. I'm going to. By you. Our debt was settled. This is a favor. For a friend. What does friendship mean nothing these days? Ah, uh, hello? What's the deal? This is him. Javier. He's flying off to Liberty City this afternoon. <whistles> and he's taking some files of mine. Innocent files that um, I need back. There's a gun set up in the hills. I have a man watching at the airport. We'll let you know, and when he flies by, shoot him down and get the files back. Okay. A man was a pay. <laughs> huh? Trevor, come on. You still want a drink? Not now! Pendeja! Que no ves que estoy hablando con las gentes aquí? All right. You grab a vehicle, something versatile. I'll handle the gun. All right. Or the observatory. I'll let you handle that. So let's stay in touch on the headset. I'll have a vehicle. Whatever I came in on is gone. Hey, this'll do. Aaron. Nope. Oh, sports car. Two miles. We're taking the sports car. What the hell? <laughs> hey, you. Get out. Yet. Start heading that way. By the way, I know why you took me there to that guy's house. Understood. Understood what? That he's a terrifying psycho and that we might have that in common? What is it? We gotta work for him. We don't gotta work for anyone, but I read you, man, loud and clear. What are you talking about? All that Aztec stuff. Those weird little artifacts. What? Oh. The little fertility Healing. statues, whatever. The guy has trouble. Case in the joint. We didn't agree to a fee for this job, so what's it all about? Okay, the guy lives well. That don't mean we're robbing him, but it does mean he's got money to pay people who help him. When the time comes, he'll do the right thing. If he don't, please, let me handle it. You don't get a wife like that without being rich and an asshole, right? What the fuck? 
He hit a wall. He deserved it. Let me off. Oh, shit. I mean, for the music. It's not kicking in. It's in my left ear. Oh, it's alternating. Got it. At least, at least we know the audio isn't defective. Get in the van. Damn it! I got this good car for nothing. All right, I see the van with the gun in it. You nearby? Not far out. Shoot the plane down, and I'll be ready. Okay. Get in the vehicle? Uh. Oh. T, if you can okay. see this gun, it might convince you Martin Madrazo ain't someone to be messing with. The fancier the gun, the bigger the pussy who owns it. Now take down the jet. That wind direction, Come too. Come on. I got her. Southwest of the city. The oh, jet's thanks. Moving. You're giving me a Gotta leading shot. Gotta a lead. Nice. Oh no, it's going down. Plane's coming down. You want it? There you are. Yes, you can. Thinking, like, don't land in the middle of the road.
Sure thing, but seriously, bro, coming all the way out here, we gotta get paid. Just do the job. I'll get us paid down the road. This is just business, buddy. Kevlar reinforced suitcase. Indestructible. T, how'd it go? Fine, just fine. I got the files. I'll take them to Madrezzo and explain the human cost of this errand. Oh, take it easy, man. Listen to me. We'll talk about that later. I want you to just drop off the files. I gotta get rid of this rifle, then we'll talk. So how are we getting rid of this rifle? Just dumping it in the lake? the van. Alrighty then. What is this shit? What is this bullshit? I was kind of hoping that I could just ride up the wall like a ramp and blow it up in the middle of nowhere. So I don't have to deal with any cops on me. There we are. Where did I get this? Didn't do a very good job, did I? Why is this so difficult? Where's the gas canister on this? Or the gas, uh... Where do you insert gas on this thing? I don't see a gas cap. Alrighty then. The old-fashioned way it is. Now we need to get a new ride. But mission successfully accomplished. I need to definitely not hitchhike. Oh, no. Shit. What? There's been a change of plans. You don't need to come to the ranch. Meet me at Stoner Cement Works, a little up Sonora Road from there. What are you doing, Trevor? Nothing you wouldn't do. Trevor. Mm. Ah, I wouldn't do. Well, no, I don't believe that. I see some bad drivers with you. Go to oh. the Cement Works. All right. This route is faster, why is it telling me not to go this way? You, the speed limit is, is even 50. Oh, that's why. With style. <laughs> I even got a 
270 out of that. Where is he? I beat him here. Car. Man, that piece of turd, huh? No wonder people are stabbing him in the back. What happened? Cheap bastard. You know, I really don't know why you mess around with people like that, Mike. I mean, really, I Trevor, don't. Answer fucking question. I asked for a fair day's pay after a fair day's work. Then he kind of got a little angry. So I admit, I kind of got a little angry. Did you kill him? What kind of fucking animal do you take me for? No, I didn't kill him. Oh, fuck. But I did kidnap his wife. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, oh, that's shit. when that line happens. What did you do? <laughs> oh, I just told you what I did. I, I, I've seen yeah. that line before. Now, oh, shit. Uh, unfortunately, I think that we're going to have to lay low for a little while. Well, you know, we discuss things with Martin. Oh, you think? Why don't you pop in the back? All right, now, Patricia, she already called shotgun. <laughs> now, I know a nice oh, little shit. place we can hang out. You know, it's a, a very relaxing little spot. This is supposed Get to be away. a simple it's job. In the woods. You know what I'm saying. Mission passed. It is pace, not for a little getaway. It's moving away from them for a little bit. D. You hood, chop. I came out all this way. Where's my car? Oh, he, he came from his house. Devin. They're laying low in the country. Switch unavailable. Come on, shop. Going for a long walk. Can we have him join us? Okay, that, that's that's a ramp. So we we got we gotta do it. Look at that asshole. Yes. There we go. Get on in here. Come on. Come on, shop. Yeah, there we go. All right, let's let's hit this. That's all you had to say. Where do I go for it? Property management. We just gotta pick up and deliver it? Okay. Oh, my wheel screwed up. We need a new car. <laughs> Let's go, chop. Oh, it's the bullet. I think the bullet was one of my favorite cars when I played San Andreas. 
if I recall correctly. Really, I have to... Where are you going? Forget how to call Chop. I don't remember the controls. Oh well, he can handle himself. He's a big boy. Prescription Cannabis. So it's, it's, it's a time trial, okay. Sure. I think we earn more money by completing these missions. Pretty sure that's how it works. Nobody ever said anything about the condition of the vehicle. a little fast for a uh, big truck like this. Gotta try it. No, it was it was worth the shot. I think we need to I definitely think we need a uh, motorcycle for that one. I need to look up the date of the GTA 6 trailer. The thing I'm most curious about is how is if they're going to have a single protagonist or if it's going to be swap protagonists like GTA 6 again. Or GTA 5 again. deliver it to the rear. Yeah. It's okay, we got time, we got a minute. There we go. We delivered the best success message. Let's do Devin first. We'll catch back up with uh, those two in a minute. Weenie. See, with 32k in my name, I cannot afford anything. I'm excited for the later parts of the game when we just start getting more money than we know what to do with. Pretty sure that's what's gonna happen. It's like the natural uh, development.
That was interesting. Who's Devin again? Hey, Molly. I'm outside the studio. All right. Go over the wall and find the car on the lot. And then what? Only the principal actors and stunt people are authorized to go near it. So you could get in wardrobe and play the part or try something else. All right. When you're out of there and clear of studio security, call me. What, well, are we going to get get disguised? And I tried Hitman once. I played uh, Hit, Hitman Absolution. I could not play that game for shit. Disguises are not my forte. Knock out the actor to get his clothes. Shut up. <laughs> yeah, nobody will ever know. Nazi. Act like I belong, right? They need you on set. Where the hell is Brandon? Jesus, are you gonna find him? Someone's gotta find him. Anyone know who this guy is? Is this the new stun guy? Yeah. I thought I had final approval on all stunt performers. Please Stop him, you idiot! Ass. Drop it! Hey, Please. shoo what? away from that car! Please. I'm not this guy! I Get out of the car! Ah, oh, damn. I don't know if there was any other way to do this. Oh, shit. Security. Some very dedicated security. This button says fight. <laughs> oh, it's like a secret Asian car. Wow, we were barely moving. I got the car and it was messy. That's fine with us, but your associate, Michael DeSanta, has done some work at the studio and he might not be so happy. Yeah, yeah, whatever. What kind of shape is the car in? Well, whatever. We plan on refitting the guns to take live ammunition. Do the traffic oh. spike and ejector seat need replacing too? Spikes, yeah. Ejector seat? But the seats is fine. Good. One more thing. Mr. Weston's security detail are concerned about a suspicious figure near the garage. Let us know if you see something. Hmm. Gonna do some more secret agent stuff, I guess? Drop spikes on the suspicious guy? Insurance companies hate these kinds of claims. They don't like cats with the inside edge shorting them either. So how'd it go? It's moving up, you know, movie people. You know what the irony is? I'm a major shareholder in that same studio, so we just did is practically legal. Ha! Ah, practically. <laughs> oh shit! Look at this motherfucker. Oh. You doing it big, my nigga, on the set. 
Lamar, what the fuck are you doing here? Oh, chirped your boy Trevor. It's fucked up when you gotta get your GPS location on your homeboys to a motherfucking <laughs> speed freak. True that. Devin Weston, master of the two-hour female orgasm. What it is, home? Lamar Davis. He was just leaving. Hey, not on my account. You looking for gainful employment, homie? Hell yeah, I'm always trying to get some motherfucking paper. Just the type of guy I like to work with. Predictable. Hey, we could bring your boy here in on the last part of the shipment. Oh, yeah, nigga, that's exactly what you could do. That's exactly Hell what you yeah. could do right man, there, look, man. Exactly. If you want him in, then you get him to boost the rest of the shit you got. Oh. Give me my money and I can go on oh, with my motherfucking oh. life. Oh, no, am I sensing tension here, Slick? <gasps> He's the spirit, but you're the brains. Am I wrong? I can see it. Look, I need you on point when we move this stuff out of town. <laughs> Yeah, whatever, man. Franklin Call just wants to live his done. life. And after this, make sure we got our motherfucking check, all right? Ciao, baby. It is what it is. Yeah, whatever. Anyway, come here. I'm going to put you in touch with my legal counsel. Hey, hey, don't touch me, homie. I don't get down like that. Yeah, let me tell you how the world works, Slim. <laughs> Mission passed. Deep inside. Let's see, we got an easy... Don't got an easy getaway. Curiosity, this is a property you can buy, right? Yeah. Pretty much the only time we're going to be getting big bucks is going to be from... I'm going to try to do this. It's from... Uh... Ice. That's what I'm looking for. Ice stick. There, now we got a ride. I look after it, homie, for real. It's got to lose the cops, right? This car does not have as good acceleration now as open. I gotta kill times, because he can't, can't have him turn around and finding us. Going the other way. Nice. Hey, you got all the luck. Well, let's see if we can make it to the street race. Hopefully, we got enough time. Hell yeah, I'm ready. <laughs> Racing in the suit. Dressing for the occasion. All these fancy sports cars are gonna get destroyed by this slow rider. Wow. Yeah, this thing is low pickup, but it has a decent top speed. Oh 
probably be fine. As long as they don't crash. See him trying to catch up on the map. It looks like the rubber banding is like preventing him from actually staying right on my butt. So long as I'm going full speed. Song kind of just ended very abruptly. care. It's gonna be so good to play another game that has its own actual soundtrack someday. Yeah. Yeah, they got a new, they got a new girl to start the start the races. All right. That was fun. Get a taxi. You got any cabs available? I'm sending one out right now. All right, thanks. Prompt service. Yeah, I should check out the, uh... Not my cab. That's my cab. Give me a second. So my current profit is okay. So it's just gonna slowly go up. So it's a long-term uh, investment play. Hey, hey, hey. I was on my phone, but I'm here now, buddy. Where you headed, homie? <laughs> Immediately get rear-ended. Must have been one of the race hey, contestants. Dressed for a success. Let's go see what the hell's going on.
you at, man? Your house is empty. Oh, hey. I had to kind of leave. Cool transition. A while. Yeah, that nice Mexican we met. Me and T did that job for him. And we fell out. You gotta be joking. I wish I was. Minor turbulence. Desert? Out by Alamo Sea? Alright, well, I'll hit you if I find anything. Absolutely. Uh, oh, hey. Trevor's got his wife. Trevor's got a wife? No, no, the Mexican's wife. What? <laughs> Shit, I don't know what to say about that one. Nothing. Nothing to say about that. Run! Run! I'm back! Heavy Trevor! And bring me my coffee, I'm gonna cut your arm off. Absolutely! <laughs> what the hell's that, your maid? Oh, business partner. Good guy. Very loyal. Ron, Ron, that is Michael. And this is Patricia. <laughs> ah, listen, beautiful. You know, I'm sorry about everything that's happened. And that, you know, I can't guarantee no harm's gonna come to you. I might have to chop you up into little pieces before spraying your pulp mess down the drain, but I really hope it doesn't come to that. I appreciate your honesty. <laughs> you are a good man. I can see that. You need your eyes examined then. Ron, you miss me? Yeah, Trevor, a bit, I mean. How's the fucking business? I, I, I tried. What? I'm just gonna give me a sob story. I'm gonna rip your fucking throat out and shove a turd down the hole. It's not a sob story. He tried? It's just not quite come good yet. But I heard about something to do with Meriwether. Mm, those assholes Big again. cache of weapons they got coming in. So I thought you might want to, uh, requisition it. Fantastic. Let's go. Oh, man. Whoa, no, 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 not you. Sit down. You're a wanted man. Stay low. <laughs> and watch her, okay? She's a good lady. Let's go, Ron. Good to meet you, Michael. Fucking come on, let's go. He was down to help. <laughs> The weapons are coming in by air. We've got a plane over at the airstrip. But... Right, let's go. Get in the plane. I've never seen it. What are you going to do? We're not going to take out a private army on the ground, Ron. We got to meet him in the air. Uh, uh... What? Okay, well, I knew that you were pissed. After Gonna get our fighter plane training in? That was bullshit. Right, right. So I've been monitoring chatter, tapping into Meriwether networks. Feels good to be back in the company of a professional. I gotta say, I got it. I was expecting something a little more impressive. The late, great Michael Townley. Not so late and not so great, right? And no longer called Townley. The years have not been terribly kind. What's the end game, man? We had a good thing going without him. If it's such a good thing, where's my money, huh? Where's my consultancy and my big fat dividend? I want a franchise network, Ron. I want reward cards, merchandise. I want to make gun violence and drug dependency accessible to every man and beast. Oh. I wanted to hear the rest of his uh his rant. Crop duster? That's the best we can do. Call our guys south of the border. Tell them there's a fire sale. It's a crop duster with a minigun on it. Maybe. I'll get you on the CV. See if I can remember how to fly a plane. I think we're good. Got to get into the air. Come on, you can do it. Yeah, there we go. Stay low, noted. How low? Cargo 
All the cargo planes staying close to the ground, noted. I know it isn't my place to ask. Interception. I'm curious about that too. Are we just going to like battlefield for it? Hop out of our plane and grab onto the grab onto theirs. Well, it's not as cool when you don't uh, rocket launcher another guy. fly next to it. I'm still sort of intercept, of course. I need to catch up to this thing. They're too high. Drop down before they figure it ain't an aberration. You got bad information, brother. I'm fine. Trying the high's gonna draw attention. You know, Ronald. I love these yes men. Oh, he's turning. Siri is a little busy. You speak to Oscar, the Mexicans, this deal on? I'll let them know it's in the works. The works? I'm not risking life and limb for a shimmonate soul. Are you sure? It's just Oscar don't like getting messed with. Do the deal. The guns are good as ours. Okay. As bad as I am at flying planes, I've always wanted to play the Ace Combat series. Alright. Because it's just... Like... Fun fighter plane arcade shooty shooty. Both slightly more realistic flying controls. Lightly. We are boarding. Fly inside the cargo plane. 
Boom. Not with the control room for a second. Enemy operative. That's real nice. I didn't see who was behind there. No. Have we got a pilot on board? <laughs> Come in, air traffic control. There has been a change of personnel and destination on the Merriweather jet. We are now landing in Mackenzie Field. <laughs> this is not going to be an easy landing. Swapping radio channels. Over. Run. Run, you there? I got the jet. You with the buyers? We are here, T. Awaiting your arrival. Thankfully, the military was not wise of this. And, oh, if there is military oh, jets. Looks like a problem. Attention, Mary Weather Jet. We are under orders to escort you to base. Change course or we will engage. Oh, are you good diddle yourself? Hey, Ron. So, um, the freaking Air Force are on me. Shit. Gain some altitude. Why gain we'll altitude? Any offensive action will be met with overwhelming retaliation. Maybe I'll give you 10% of what's in the hole. Then we're all happy. Let's keep going up. We're going to fucking space. We hit the limit. I don't think we can go any higher. Maybe. Authorization process complete. Clear to engage. Eagle one, Fox two. Eagle two, Fox two. They shot me. This goose is cooked, Ron. Ron, Ron, you hear me? So I guess we weren't actually uh, succeeding on this mission. Okay.
What's this music? Well, I guess that counts. Well. That sucked. I was hoping we would get a good payday. Trevor! Shit, are you okay? I saw the plane go down. I survived, and Lizard Army didn't do so well, so that's something. Ah, oh, thank do? God. The fuselage went into the Alamo Sea. You might be able to salvage the hardware with dive gear or something. It's an idea. Oh, good idea. But it'll take time. Tell Oscar he ain't getting these guns. Okay. Look, I gotta ask. Are you in with the federal government? An agent, Sanchez, was round here saying you and Michael had to meet his supervisors at the garage, the cook site. Fuck, I gotta do this, okay? But I'm using them, all right? They, they ain't using me. Let's make that clear. New mission, B. And Franklin has a mission of Lamar. But I'm interested in the, uh... Whatever this question mark is over here. Main, wait. Main some of Mr. Chang's people came, but they replaced. They seem a whole lot tougher than the guys met at the end, and they're gonna talk to you. Get an answer. In Sandy Shores, helping Ron run the business. Oh, you need me to come over? Bizarrely, we're coping just fine without you. Stay with Floyd. Anyone asks, you don't know where I am. But I do know. Civil Border Patrol. What? Passport, давай, ебать, мам. I don't fucking understand you. А да ты по английски не шаришь? Что за хуйня с тобой? Я говорю, паспорт покажи. Все вы нелегалы как один. Language Russian. Гражданским арестом, ты понял? Америка страна возможностей, а я воспользуюсь возможностью послать тебя обратно через границу, откуда ты приперся. What? Very good, Joseph. Real fine. We'll make a civilian protector of our nation's borders from undesirable elements of you yet. Sorry, citizen, just a training exercise. Ah, okay. Well, I'm so glad that you patriots are out here defending this fine American desert sand. Well, thank you. When you could be in town fucking some girls and further destroying the gene pool. Hey, there's a real problem here. Да, люди мотивированы необходимостью прокормить свои семьи. Едут сюда работать по черному за копейки и прут, прут в эту страну. It's a disaster. And that's why we form the Civil Border Patrol. Oh God. Wait, 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 wait. My patriot meter's going off. Huh? <laughs> come on, both of you. We've got some illegals over them hills. Come on, come on, you drive. You drive, let's go. Drive, get in the back. <laughs> okay. What's your name, sir? Not even close I'm to John what I expected. Joseph. Trevor. Okay, Trevor. Well, it's saying we need to head for the Yellow Jack Inn. Oh, good. They love me in there. Oh, I'm definitely getting a strong reading. The Patriot Meter predicts undesirables with up to 79% accuracy. <laughs> Surely 30 of the, the time, it's accurate. 100% I mean, of the I'm time. With freaks, but you two losers cannot be for real. Unfortunately, this is as real as it gets. These people are criminals who threaten our way of life and drive down our property prices. Они думают, что могут приехать сюда в поисках лучшей жизни для себя и своей семьи. Это противоречит Конституции. Come one, come all, I say. This country's got bigger problems to deal with. 
Well, that's because you've been brainwashed by the secular media. Don't you worry, though. We'll convert you. My brother showed some, uh, well, let's just call it sexual weakness in his younger days. But now he's a happily married man with three children, and he rarely acts out. Hey, if you do well in your civil board at patrol trial, we will, of course, pay you for your time. Last time I looked, this was still a service-driven market economy. This I have to see. Here we are. No I can only see this ending in a very entertaining Wait, way. Inside? Go see if you can flush them out, Trevor. Is there any place in the world I'd rather be than drunk as a skunk at the Alamo Sea? I said to the wife, bitch, I'm going out for a snack. That was ten years ago and I... Shut up. This isn't happening. Hey, what's your problem? <laughs> Gotta hold back the anger. Hey, you're banned. Is anyone not banned? Don't you cause no trouble now. Don't worry, I'm only gonna cause a little bit of trouble. Oh, this is pointless. Everyone in here has done something illegal. Get in the patrol vehicle. Neck. Hey, Trevor, get out here now! They're in that car, let's go! Alrighty then. Go, go! Let's bring him in, boys. Here, take oh. the stun gun. Really? Nobody needs to die here. We're civilized people. Can you believe they're singing? It's like they don't even care. Buddy, you can keep your socialist ballad to revolution and discontent to yourself. Damn, they're off roading. We're taking the scenic route. They're a law unto themselves. I don't know. They come here taking our job. All those mariachi singer jobs have been stolen. They don't just take one. No. Some of them are doing two or three thankless low pay jobs to support their families. It's an outrage. Sounds like they're having a lot more fun in their car. Look at them, drunk out of their minds on Uncle Sam's dime. These guys did not fell out for the off-road tires. Ah, back to off-road. Hey, hey, you, stop the vehicle! This is a citizen's arrest! Well, of course they wouldn't understand me. Now would they, Joseph? Look, now, now's our chance. Don't subdue those illegals, Trevor. I want to see how you handle that stun gun. Uh, where's the stun gun? Oh. If we turn on each other, uh, we won. <laughs> Sorry about that, pal. Don't apologize to them. They're the ones breaking the law here. Okay, okay. I do what you say. Mierda! Oh, very nice, Trevor. Respectful, but firm. We can handle it from here. Get in the vehicle. You paid your fun. It's time to go home. Please, no more. I go with you. You don't like music? Okay. We got a we got a we got a stun gun now. They were nice enough to give us a new weapon. Well, thanks for the help, citizen. America's a little bit safer because of you. Democracia. <laughs> Very entertaining. Some good money. Let's do some of this. It's been a while since we've done this. We made like 40 grand or something. Passively. Four from this. Trevor! You know, I've 
I've been thinking about it. I'm not quite sure if I'm ready to accept an apology. Where is my wife? Patricia my wife. doesn't want to speak to you. Frankly, neither do I. I will find you. Okay. Well, I'll put some coffee on that. I'll see you soon. <laughs> this is Weasel News. Building up deep inside disrupted by audacious car theft. A source says baseball legend Carl Wilkins used performance enhancing drugs. The stock market plunges deep into painful territory and illegal immigrants begin to wonder if America is a third world country. It is. A multi-million dollar car rigged with special effects was stolen from the Richards Majestic lot in a daring and violent heist. Initial reports suggest some injuries and possible casualties. We'll stay on this story. Sports news. The grueling stress of being a professional athlete takes its toll in a culture where being number one is everything. And those that are number two... Ammunition now has parachutes. All right. The source is saying that Corker's baseball legend Carl Wilkins frequently used performance-enhancing drugs before... <laughs> Good to see you settle down with a lovely woman. Critics responded in see if we can clear up this misconception. ...sports heroes shouldn't have to use drugs to maintain a strong turgid erection and give that girl uh, this is Cletus I got both hands on a gun right now so leave a mess volatility is okay let's let's earn some some cash armor piercing pistol got another pickup the drop is by some houses near the coast I'll punch in the location of the GPS yes Oh wait, automatically GPS is, doesn't it? Oh no, it does. Okay. Do you care? Traffic. Almost. That was entirely your fault. That was almost perfect. But almost. It's not perfect. We're going to be kind of close. Got it. This, this should be easy to lose them. We just gotta run up the mountain. Surely they're not in off-road vehicles too, right? Here we are. Perfect. Good shit. Watch your back there, Trevor. Other vehicles coming in. I got company. Right. 
Where are they even going? Surely they know where I am, right? Damn, I was actually hoping that I could make that. But I wasn't using a full auto weapon, and I don't know how to switch to one on the driver's seat. Oh. Okay. Now that's disappointing. The only other route is driving up the mountain, and that would be way too slow. Yeah, I'll, I'll lose them when I drive up the mountain. There we go, no more cops. Now we just finish our ride up the mountain and down the mountain. There we are. Movement on the scatter band coming your way. So how far out of our way do we have to go to lose these runners? Okay. I took the liberty of killing them all. The what? Them, they must have rammed into something so hard they got themselves killed. I'll take it. Small victories. They're gonna get in my way, so they're asking for it anyway. All right, one of these. Captain Phillips to ground control. You want the good news or the bad news? <laughs> How bad can it be? Those hillbilly local runners, they moved in on your airfield and are using it as a base. What? What? I will fucking destroy them! Yeah, I thought you'd say that. So the good news is, my guys fitted the plane with a new carpet bombing system. Instead Ooh. of a single bomb, you can now drop a chain. Just make sure you have several targets lined up beneath the plane before releasing, so we don't waste ammo. Oh, I won't waste any. Got 
gonna burn and line it up. Turn around. Fuck you too. Yeah, these aren't like the same missions over and over. You're getting some new dialogue and variations. The mission. Not the smoothest landing. But we made it. Back home in one piece. But people, not so lucky. TP Industries Arms Race. First Mackenzie, Alfred Hingle, and win the arms race. Does that mean we won? Oh, this is a piece of crap. Let's see, what do we do now? I think we go to here. Oh, fib. I'm sure they caught wind of a certain somebody kidnapping a certain someone. Sensationalist propaganda. I call it delicious. You know, the news is coming up next. This is Weasel News. A Merryweather cargo plane shot down by military fighter jets. I know about that. Same exact energy as Ketray. Oh, of course they're at the meth lab. Of course they are. Hanging out upstairs. How do we get upstairs?
The Lido score setup? Nice place you got here. Oh, yeah. It's easy to mock, isn't it, huh? Cheap and fucking easy. <laughs> but uh, this... This here is my place. And my work paid for my place. All right, relax. I was just being sarcastic. Yeah, well, don't be, all right? Because the world doesn't need any more sarcasm. It's the blight of the age. Yeah, I get the point. You, you don't get the point. You're like every other asshole. You made a bit of money, and you became a turd. Got news for you. I was always a turd. No! You weren't, man. You were something. But now, man, you know, you're like this place. You're a shell. Go fuck yourself. Are you some kind of pure, morally justifiable asshole? What, because you're, you're, you're totally psychotic, somehow it's okay? I'm honest, all right? You're the hypocrite. Oh, yeah, you're a fucking hero. So far above it all. Oh, yeah, well, I'm not above ripping open your fucking chest to see what's replaced your heart. Rip it open. See what's there, baby, because I'm ready. Hello? Oh, ladies, ladies, what's up? Fuck off! Listen, I'm sorry, but we've got a problem. Government funding thing. We need you to uh, uh, investigate a research lab upstate. It's about terrorism, the big one, nerve gas, biological terror. Thank God I don't pay tax. Uh, listen, you'll need some fairly standard gear. Boat, tandem rotor heavy helicopter, truck, Weapons. You'll have to source all of that. <laughs> Chopper alone will set you back a couple of mil. Oh, no worries there. Yeah. He just came into a lot of money. Is that sarcasm? Oh, you're fucking A right at sarcasm. You fuck. A few weeks ago, I was happily retired, sulking by my swimming pool. My sulking. psychotic best friend shows up out of nowhere to torture me over mistakes I made. Honest mistakes I made over a decade ago. We, our little posse, are flat fucking broke. But hey, let's go out and spend two million dollars on a tandem rotor fucking chopper so I can go steal nerve gas from fucking terrorists. Forgive me, you ignorant fuck. But sarcasm is all I fucking got. Sarcasm and a room full of you cunts. Yes. Woo. Welcome back, man. It is the old you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, we gotta go. It's been great, but Dave here's got a Pilates class. Now, remember, ladies, you keep us way out of this thing. Bye bye. It never ends. Oh, Jesus. All right. I'll give Lester a fucking call. He said he knew about something. Now, you tell him that we're driving towards Polito Bay. Come on. You're driving us up to the bank. My car is my car outside. By my car, I mean Michael's. Or are we taking the classic? Michael's car is in fact outside. Much better than the piece of crap you're driving. Much, much better. Get in. Piece of shit. No. There we are. This is a long drive. Let me call Lester. What now? We got a funding problem, so we need a job. Before the jewel store, you talked about a score, a, a bank in the sticks. I need you to meet us there. Polito Bay, right? That's the one. I'll get on a bus. And he'll still beat us. Despite right, our speeding. Let's meet us there. Don't start. I won't. No way. Good call. If you're taking down a bank for a few million, first thing you do is call the hospital and tell them to get you a guy in a wheelchair. Oh, this AC bank, you gonna be carrying that kind of change? Local law enforcement extort money from all the weed farms, whorehouses, meth kitchens in the area. They keep their cash in safe deposit boxes. Then there's all the normal small town payroll stuff. We should do well. You know, I've been thinking about you, Trevor. Your lifestyle. Oh, have you? Really? Yes, I have. People always try to label you. You know? Maniac, psycho, friend, industry leader. Uh, some ways you defy categorization. But then, what? Think about it. Where you live. Sandy Shores, you precious ass. I'm sorry there ain't a place nearby for you to get your colonics. Right. But why? Are you out here? It's off the grid. We're away from it all. 
It's somewhere real and authentic. This is America! And real people ain't been priced out yet. Yeah, well, what if it gets gentrified? Then I'll fucking move. Okay. What about the way you dress? What about it? I don't give a shit what I wear. No, no, no. If you don't give a shit, you wear clean clothes that fit. So yours are all a little out there, a little wacky. <laughs> Whatever's in the shop is what I get. Jesus, what, what is this? It's not an absence of taste, he. It's the opposite of taste. You should be a stylist. And then there's the tattoos, the hair, the weird music. The funny toy. The weird music. The what are you talking drugs. about? The everything. What the fuck are we talking about? You are a hipster. Oh. Like, you're a hipster. I hate hipsters. Classic hipster denial. I abhor hipsters. I eat them for fun. <laughs> hipsters love saying they hate hipsters. <laughs> what I really fucking do. Self-hatred, common hipster affliction. Well, it'll be because I'm living out here away from the bean machines and the bankers. You're gentrifying. Bean machines? Coffee Soon, shops? The skinny jeans will show up, then the skinny lattes, and then the bankers. And you'll be somewhere else starting the cycle all over again. Maybe you're not a classic garden variety hipster, but you're what the hipsters aspire to be. You, Trevor. Are the proto hipster? <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. I don't agree with what you're saying. You're talking bullshit. You're trying to wind me up, but I'm very, very angry, and I want this conversation to stop right away. Hipster. Fuck you. <laughs> Fuck you, Michael. Say it again. I made my point. I'm not a sadist. <laughs> All right, we made it. Stops up here. All right, how long does it take us to get out here from LS? Sleep, sleep in the car. Come on, man, knock it off. I'm gonna break your fucking fingers, you don't knock that shit off. Well, please, all right? You'd alleviate the boredom. Ah, finally. Hey, hey. Hey. Welcome to paradise. Come on, car's this way. It's dry out here. Don't worry, brother. Mark will take care of all your moisturizing needs. Mm. Oh. Shall we? Might as well get started. Let's talk business. Okay, let's take a look at this bank. Oh, front wheel drive. I will go to the front of the bank, clock the entrance. If the paperwork's correct, the alarm will be a relic. You should be in and out before the local PD knows what's happening. <laughs> it's highly fortified, like a fucking fortress. Wouldn't be able to get in if you tried. Let alone out. And that's the entrance to the bank. Nothing special. They take us around back. Okay. I like it. Yeah, the place is remote. It's got the right amount of foot traffic. This'll do. Mm -hmm. It's not ideal. It's gonna cost more to break that system than the score is gonna pay. Well, we're gonna have to find a new score. No, 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 uh-uh, no, no. This is the score. What are our options? It's a dumb idea, but we could trigger the alarm. See what kind of response they throw out. That is a dumb idea. Hey, you heard the man, all right? Shoot the sucker. My pistol doesn't have a silencer on it? Why? This has a suppressor. Nice and quiet. Get back in the car. Oh, 
watch from the station that dispenses gas. Dispatched four cars in 60 seconds and more on standby, and it isn't even 30 Victor shots fired. Oh, this is a real headache. What do you got on the clock? 40 seconds. This is Toledo Security. Any updates on the Code 30 Adam? Backup ready to mobilize. This is not normal. The response is out of proportion. The cops in this county are dirty. The alarm just went off on their piggy bank. Here come the cops. This is them. What is that, a 67 second response time? Four cars, more in the wings. Bad cops, garden dirty money. Fuck how many, we can take this. Wait right here. We'll see if anything about their routine suggests a weakness. Polito Radio, this is Polito Car 3. We have a code 12, false alarm. Possibly triggered intentionally. Roger that. We're gonna set up checkpoints on the Great Ocean Highway and the Sonora Freeway. Car to car searches and record checks. Checkpoints? Searches? Fuck this! I ain't getting caught because Lester needs a wheelchair. Hey! Wheelchair or not, we're still faster than your ass. <laughs> Race Michael with Trevor's office. All right. As much as I want to listen to a different song, we got Eurobeat. It's all that won't get copyright struck. little tunnel also I like how the GPS goes out while you're in a tunnel that's a that's a neat attention to detail oh, okay then <laughs> hit a rock died Three miles of driving. Three miles. Oh, that rubber banding, you piece of shit. I saw how fast they were moving on the map there.
shit, again. Somehow, we're still good. So I'm going to guess if you were with Michael, it would be, uh, you have to beat Trevor. Just letting you choose who to race as. Oh, shit. Fucked it. Jesus, what took you so long? Had to let you win. <laughs> Set up a board over here. Oh. Michael, man, your blood sugars are low. I'm making you some leftovers. I'm fine, T. Huh? No, I'm the host, man. You know, I don't want you to get hungry and moody, right? Then you're going to be making the wrong decisions. Man, I've been making wrong decisions my whole life. That's how I ended up here. Here you go. Bon appetito. Jesus Christ, Trevor, what is that? What's wrong with you? That's just a... Good old-fashioned like, rule. An eyelid. That's probably not even human. Unless that gas station job. Gentlemen, some plans for your attention? Oh, good. I'm going to stay here a minute longer than I have to. So I think our little, uh, experiment showed that the response will be too quick to beat and too strong to walk through. That means you gotta face the cops head on. Dirty cops. Uh, the dirty cops head on. Head on. Man, I don't know. Well, you'll be prepared. Convoys carrying military-grade hardware pass near here to get to Fort Zancudo. I propose hijacking one and using the equipment to get an edge on the locals. I can get you the exact details of the shipment as soon as we're done here. Anyway, you won't be outside the bank too long. Polito Bay is, well, it's a bay. So you're a street away from the water where Franklin can be waiting in a boat to get you out of there. Okay. I know none of this is ideal, but it's the only way I can see of taking the score and providing for your FIB paymasters. Fine. We need personnel? Just a gunman. He'll be taking on the cops with you, so my advice? Choose someone good. Uh, think about my buddy Chef, okay? Consummate professional. He's looking pretty good. This guy is a piece of shit, but, uh, yeah. He's just picked somebody good. So I'm thinking we bring Chef along. You sure this is the guy? That should do. I'll get the equipment together. Michael, you reach out to Franklin. Trevor, mm -hmm. you do what you do. Roger that. I'll call you when we're ready to move on this. Mm, you want to bunk with us? I mean, it's going to be tight, but, you know, me casa, su casa. I, I'll get a motel, thanks. You make it more interesting dialogue if we bring the friends along, too. Adios, amigos. Hmm? Yeah, that's expected. <laughs> Pretty violent, immediate response to the bad food. Well, uh, Franklin, buddy, what's up? Hey, look, there's these redneck dudes been looking for you, homie. Some angry motherfuckers. Ooh. I found where they stay, man, and I've been following them. Okay, well, it's got to be the O'Neill brothers. <laughs> what's left of them? I'll pick up Michael and we'll come to you. T, hey, man. <laughs> so he's over there. All right. 
question mark for Franklin. Show me what it is. Damn, he's really in the middle of nowhere. Back to Sandy Shores. Why didn't I hear about it? God damn it. Shit. They see us, man. We gotta stay on. We need the real music. That's right, chop. We're gonna fuck them up as soon as Trevor get here. <laughs> Hey man, me and Chop on these bumps. We're coming up to WH, north of Chu Miles. All right, all right, the O'Neill brothers are coming to us. I think they was about to send one of them anti-tank rockets into your best Pucci condo when one of your roomies told them that you was gone. Okay, so if you're on the WH, that means you'll be coming through Ratton Canyon, right? Shit, I guess. Good. Me and MT are gonna take the company chopper and meet you there. Company chopper, yes, Michael, it's a tax write-off. Frank, you still there? Yeah, I'm just about holding on to the road. We're taking the chopper and we'll head you. Where do we even get this Deal vehicle anyway? Business stealing pricks on the road. Hey, dog, can you like get on it? Cause these dudes is rolling hard. We're five minutes out from the chopper. All right. Fucking hell! Hell! Shit! 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 Let's roll on this food, chop. Do it. Oh, shit! <laughs> Trevor, man, shit, you there? There was a deer in the road, man. These motherfuckers crashed out. They crashed? They dead? No, nope. they gone. They ran into the fucking woods, man. I need air support, like, right fucking now. And here comes the chopper. Don't worry. Incoming. Or not. <laughs> I guess that's one way to start the mission. Incoming? Man, you're all business. Yeah, well, this is kind of important. These men don't like me, and they know we're back in the sandy shore, so... Here she is. The Biz Alley. Remember, she ain't mine. She's the company's. So we're gonna have Michael gunning people down from it? That should be interesting. Frogger helicopter. Look. Why do these guys Minced the bird. want you dead anyway? There was a deal. The contract to end all. Serious multinational stuff. I was this close, and they stole it off me. Ho ho hold up. If they stole your business, why do they want you dead? Wow, what's with all the questions? Can you just take my side for once? Hey, I'm coming along for the ride, ain't I? Yeah, but I sense your heart ain't in it. And I'm lucky my heart ain't in a pie on your kitchen table. Always with the quips. You're such a depressing cynic. Oh, poor Trevor. I'm sorry I'm a human being with thoughts and feelings and emotions. Wait a second. I remember this chopper. We used this to break into the IAA building. You stole it from the FIB? Not so. I took it in lieu of payment. There was a rifle on board, too, so if your panties aren't all in a twist over stolen office supplies, Please use it to scan the forest for the O'Neills. Oh, I'm your hitman now. I'm not gonna force you, Michael. You don't wanna help. You can get out right now. Stolen FIB property. I never thought that, uh... Hey, hey! We here on the ground! That's where we come from. But, uh, makes perfect sense for him.
guy. One more guy. There you are. Egyptian pose. They're gonna be heading to higher ground. Check the hill. I think I see someone to the right there. Something shit, shit, what is that? Oh, it's the anti-tank rocket. Get him, boy. What the fuck is going on here? <laughs> Fucking Matrix dodging me. Doing the Han Solo neck twitch. Hillbillies with rockets are dead. Is there anyone else we should worry about trying to kill you? Oh, sure. Yeah, there's some bikers, the Chinese, Madrezo's people, but whatever. Don't act like you're so popular. Oh, oh. smooth. My name's Shop got a new ride. All right, back to the airfield. Now. Stay. It's kind of important. You know the airfield's mine, don't you? Oh yeah, you can afford a runway, but you can't afford to move out of that corrugated metal death shack. So how you guys doing? Well, we're alive. Hey, good work down there. I'm the one who says thank you. He was helping me. Thank you, Franklin. Yeah, it's cool, homie. And thank you, Chop. Hey, are you gonna tell us exactly? Now we don't need to land on the helipad. Gotta land it. Nah, they want me on the point. Don't it feel good, huh? Helping a friend in need? Come on, Chop. Come on. Oh, yeah. Taking out some hillbilly crank dealers on a blood feud. That's what I live for. Hey, Trev, man, we're gonna borrow this and head back to town. Sure. Come on, Michael, man. I'll drop your ass off on the way back. Chop, get in. See you back in Casa Phillips, Mike. Yeah, thanks for the warning. Oh, yeah. Predator. Hmm. Helicopter spurs from website. Websites are that you land, and the helipad will be stored at helicopter area. And planes will be stored in that area as well. 
Ground vehicles too large for a garage will be stored there. Okay, most of the uranium for the Polito score. All we need is that military hardware, so move on to the convoy when you can. Got it. Gonna get rid of all of these. Finance guy, mm, my favorite. Oh, we got a new, we got a new bounty. All right, let's see, Glenn Scoville, spicy. He is at the top of Mount Chiliad. In terms of location. Appears to be the, uh, the cable car. Well, we do have a helicopter. We'll be automatically equipped in using helicopters or planes. Noted. All right, let's put on some non-copyright radio or flying. Look on and numb ourselves with another overpriced beer. Cheerleader tryouts for the Los Santos Panic began today, and Teresa Smith says she can't wait to be a Panic Girl. Oh my God, I've always wanted to shoot t-shirts at men. I have real aggression issues after my dad abandoned me and my mom. She said. <laughs> That he's standing next to a sign. Got a bike here. Indicating way to Bell's End. Appears to be the correct way. And let's look at the email real quick. That's where we are. He's going to jump, which sounds like he's he's uh base jumping. At them over there. Flag. Ah. How about to do Mother Nature Hawk? Don't you move! You're coming with me. I don't think so, bro. Okay, then. Oh, there's a parachute here.
some speed. This man, we fell far behind. Could at least give us some kind of music. Something. He landed. Where are you running to, buddy? Now heal and no begging. <laughs> well, follow me nicely. We're gonna get another shot to the kneecap. I'm guessing this probably isn't a feasible mode of transport. I mean, yes, this isn't feasible either. I'm just trying this out. That's it, bro. Outside the box. Finally, something that isn't a motorbike. Your chariot awaits, sir. Poor bag. Abba? Bro, come on, seriously? So I forgot to show for clear. No biggie. Lesson learned, let's move on. Is that the best pitch you can come up with? Are you kidding me? I pitched the world leaders, man. I'm in banking. Complex derivatives. Ah, ah, well, what are the chances? I'm in banking too. Large withdrawals. Then you know where I'm coming from. Play hard, go big, no regrets, right? All I'm regretting is not killing you, but the journey's still young. Wow, buzzkill alert. Come on, don't tell me you didn't rush your tits off back there. Z -z -zing. <laughs> An original getaway. I'll give you that. That's me, dog. Unconventional. You see my ink, right? I mean, you never guess I have an MBA. I'm going full sleeve this year, FYI. It's like when I look at you, I see homeless crackhead. But you're really a badass white knuckle bounty hunter. Dudes like you and me, we will not let normality define us. I met this hedge fund guy called Dom a couple years back who got me into the exports. Guy was a real doucherama, but he taught me. That's okay to be a douche, so long as you're spiritual and alive. It's about taking on nature and winning, and filming it. Oh, wow, and how's that working out for you? I mean, in the light of you being on your way to jail and possibly being killed on the way there. Good off, Roden. Look, it's all a big misunderstanding. Oh, of course it is. I'm a scapegoat, man. A victim of the zeitgeist. Listen, check this out. So I'm working at Schlongberg Sachs, <laughs> vice president, already at my age. I mean, basically everyone's a vice president, but I'm one of the youngest, the hungriest cub in the pack. I'm taking home high five figures a month after tax. Then the market crashes, bottom line gets wiped, the whole world goes nuts, right? People who wouldn't know a future from an option are suddenly talking about 99% this. 1% that. So, of course, we're feeling the heat. Mortgage-backed securities are bread and butter, but we're sitting tight. We know the government's got to step in. Too many fat cats with too much to lose. The bailout comes, all good. Bonuses back on, business as usual. Then, word starts spreading internally about the merch, right as I've got a line on this incredible eco-lodge in Belize. I am talking literally a mansion in paradise, bro. Awesome cave tubing down there, dude. So, I sell a few shares a little earlier than I should. 
okay, and then next thing you know, I've got the commission all over me. Talk about bad luck. What I'm saying, man, is that I think, you know, with the year I've had, I deserve to catch a break, don't you? No. Nope. Oh, you'll catch a break, all right. The only thing stopping me from shooting you right now is the happy thought of what they'll do to a white-collar criminal like you in the pen. So, why don't you sit back, shut the hell up, and dwell on that for the rest of the ride? Sound good? Okay, dude. Chill. I, I thought we were on the same page. Am I sensing a motivation slump? And we're good. Hello, Mud. Look at the two of you. Have you been keeping handsome? Uh, up and down, to be honest with you, Mud. Life can be confusing, Trevor. In my youth, I wanted to be a cheerleader, and I nearly made it to the top. But then I discovered a burning passion for justice. <laughs> that's what brought you here, huh? No, but that's another story for another day. Leave him here, and I'll send you a fresh sheet. Inside. No whining. Don't commit crimes. <laughs> Haste. Convoy is delivering stuff to Hiss. Okay, supposedly, like, we got an achievement for this. Is it just for... Oh, wait. I stopped myself from getting in the thing. Good. We need a faster ride. We got one. I'm just curious if this is it, or if it'll just keep going. Like, cycle through the missions you've already done. Success. We made it through the gate. Do we got today? Hey Trevor, next shop is happening near the trailer park. Sounds familiar. Consider it done, amigo. Be careful. Know how much rednecks like trailer parks. Oh, missed the rock. <laughs> yeah, that's how physics works. Oh, you gotta be fucking kidding me. They beat me to it. That was a little horse shit. Ah! Come on. We have a car to catch up to, and we're not going to catch up to him very easily. Gotta shoot out his tires.
They are fast. Okie dokie then. Retry. Hopefully we'll have better luck this time. Next shop is happening near the trailer park. Sounds familiar. Consider it done, amigo. Be careful. You know how much rednecks like trailer parks. Hopefully you won't get stuck on a rock. That's so stupid. You're a good time though. Perfectly balanced. Traction. Yeah, that was much better. Now we just have to make it back in two pieces. Me and the car. I guess three. Me, the car, and the package. to go a little bit faster than that, though. I'll drive up the mountain. No, oh, no, never mind. Good. Okay, I lost them. Muy bien. Still kind of funny how there was that one. There was a time when uh, they just died. H how does that even happen? They just ran. They just fell off a cliff, or they spawned underneath the world. I am very curious if we get something unique here. Or if it's going to be a repeat of a mission. Okay, I think it's just repeat missions. Let's just complete this, and we should be good. Oh. Baylow. Got it. Go to the one on the left first. Well, I don't think we have to do these missions anymore. Not unless we need money. That 
one's a hit. Good work. Hit from the airfield now. That was the last drop. Got like 7,500 each time we do that. I mean, sure, we need money, but I don't think we're ever going to need that little bit of money. We'd, better, we'd be better off proceeding through the story. Two-minute mission. Hey, we, and we still got a bike. Got something with Franklin. I guess it's to steal the boat. Minutemen. Hmm. Are Minutemen supposed to be the uh, civil enforcement guys? That hill on the left is not a ramp, but I really want to hit it like a ramp. Yeah! I was expecting to land in water. I am pleasantly surprised. We didn't have to steal another car. Ooh, we got a new, got a new uh, bounty. I think those will end eventually. Might as well do them. We get some interesting conversations out of it. Considering we don't kill them. We're not making it. Okay, never mind, we made it. Failure. We didn't get high enough. Mountain bike is shit. I'm lost. What? Can you give me a ride home, please? Sure thing. I love hitchhikers. Finally, a nice man. Thank you. I live out at Catfish View, Mount Gordo, by the lighthouse. It's very icy. Am I glad you came along? I was out hiking and got lost. I've been trying to flag down a car for over an hour. Why didn't you just call someone to come pick you up? I couldn't get Miss a signal on myself. And I don't really have anyone to call. We'll Not take the taxi Monica. back. She was very hard on me. But how I loved her. I have her hair in my backpack. Ooh. Okay. What? The days get long out at that house all alone. I don't get many visitors anymore. Gardner used to come on Fridays till he got real sick and fell off that cliff. What? Oh, well, you know how they like to talk. But now, it's just me. Living on soup. Soup I make from old soup. Soup after soup after soup. This lady is insane. I have to get out of there sometimes and clear my head. Those damn birds always singing no matter how many times I poison them. Bird soup. Soup with bird, birds with soup. Every night I think I found peace, but then morning comes and with it another fresh hell. I come up here to escape them and they're still singing, taunting me. No, the house hasn't been the same since Mama passed. Most days I just work on my project so I can be rich and have all the gentleman callers I want, like a real lady sipping on tea on a porch, you know? I love 
working with rubber, burning it, tasting it. You've got shoes. You've got feet. Am tasting I right? it, huh? Hello. Clothy cloth ears. Are you listening? You've got shoes. You've got feet. Am I right? Uh, I'm not gonna say you're wrong. But what about shoes that look like feet? <laughs> they have those. Feet toe shoes. Yes. Shoes that look like feet. That's what I just said. Shoes that look like feet. Shoes that look like feet. Feet that have shoes on them that are feet. Because, you know, you can buy those already. No, you can't, Mr. Silly Pants. How can you buy them already if I haven't made them already? Dummy, dummy, dum-dums. I like you. You're silly. The gardener was silly. He got sick. Folk talk. You sure you're okay? Are you okay? Because this He's guy not. who picked me up the other week wasn't okay. He choked to death on his own hand. Yeah, okay, it's official. You're crazy. Crazy Maisie sitting on a daisy. Oh, what are you gonna do? Spank me? Shave me? Lock me in the cellar with a spider called Molly Foster? Dress me up as That's a That's oddly specific. Drink through a little pink straw? Because you can. Mama oftentimes would. Don't pick your scars. Stop eating soil. Where's your pony, little girl? I'm Johnny now. The pony's dead. I hate you. I love you. Will you be my daddy? And this is why you don't pick up hitchhikers. <laughs> okay, I'm fine. Focus on the sunshine. Go to the garden. Pick them pretty flowers. I'm sorry. I didn't mean nothing. I get so anxious ever since Mama took Blanky away and burned him. You seem like such a nice man. Have you ever drunk a mint julep? Why do I always go and ruin everything? Just like I did with that litter of puppies. Oh. I'll just be quiet. Yeah. Maybe that's a good idea. <laughs> Why exactly are we stopped? Here you go. Thank you. Here's my number. Will you call me sometime? New I get contact. so lonely out here all by myself. I love you. Eh. Don't, don't stick your dick in crazy, fellas. Looks like Father Christmas has been a bad boy. Curtis Weaver. Let's get this up. Pinpoint. The Dignity Village Hobo Camp. Uh, wait, this area has this map, but I don't think that's right. Because the other maps are pointing somewhere else. Yeah. The other maps are pointing all the way up here. Let's call a taxi, though. I need a taxi as soon as you can. Stay where you are. I got a driver right around the corner. I'll be here. All right. Taxi to the middle of bumfuck nowhere. Let's go. Um, is that him? There he is. I can foresee in GTA 6 there being a very disgruntled taxi driver upset with apps like Uber and Lyft stealing their business. So where do you want to go? Mount Chiliad. I'll get you there fast, buddy. This is the spot, right? 
Yeah, this is the hobo camp. Capitalism is heard. Stay back. You're not taking me in. All right, all right. Stop. I'll come quietly. Pathetic. Correct decision. Come on. Road trip. <laughs> Road trip. I'm sure we could find a great vehicle. You must have really been picked on at school. Your Get it. Wait, sir. Stop pretending to be countercultural. Oh, yeah, that's a good view. <laughs> you gonna play nice now, Granddad? I'd rather die fighting Seven? than surrender to the hypocritical laws of your oppressive regime. Uh, although you did, in fact, surrender. I took a stance, didn't I? Stared the bully in the face, then back down at the last minute. That's how activism works. Not that I'd expect a mindless drone of a nanny state like you to understand. Whatever. You know, I never realized hobos were so well armed. I'm not a hobo. I've made a conscious decision to reject the capitalist society. By living in a hobo camp. It's a lifestyle choice, you government stooge. And have you looked in the mirror recently? This discrimination disgusts me. I only just got out of jail for that sitting protest outside the exchange in Liberty City. Such a sense of the power of group action. Until we all turn on each other. Hmm. What are they trying to send you down for now? I didn't pay much attention to your file. Of course you didn't. I assaulted a cop at an anti-globalization rally. Beat him up with a fire extinguisher. And I'd do it again. Screw the police. Nothing but mindless stoolies of the totalitarian regime. You're preaching to the choir, Pops. What? You're worse than they are. A paid thug of a corrupt legal system rounding up agitators for the ruling autocracy? A puppet on a power trip. I just wonder who's got their hand up your ass. Whoa! Hold on there, socialist Santa. If you want an anarchy off, <laughs> I will take you down any day. I wreak indiscriminate mayhem on an hourly basis. And secondly, no one has a hand up my ass. Would you like to look? Listen, nobody's more anti-establishment than me, old man. This is just I hate payday. authority, so watch your tone. Oh, I'm sorry. Hired mensch of the dictatorship. Did daddy not love you? No. Daddy left me at a shopping mall and never came back, so I burnt it to the ground. I've lost count of the number of people I've killed in just the last week, and I am very happy to add your name to the pile right now. So why don't you shut your mouth? <laughs> okay, we'll leave it there. Touchy subject, I see. Are you getting some perverse satisfaction out of dragging this out no just listen to you ramble kind of entertaining well if it isn't my dear old buddy trevor and he's brought me this reprobate hello mod you know i kind of look upon you as the friend i never had 
The son I never wanted and the shrink I could never afford. You do? Kinda. The pursuit of criminal men for profit is back-breaking, soul-crushing work. Oh, I can only imagine. I'm retiring, Trevor. I want a peaceful life away from all this insanity and degradation. I want a picket fence and a husband and a dog named Skip. I want the dream, Trevor, and I won't let anyone stand in my way. Good All for right. you, Maud. I wish you well on that quest. I'll find it, Trevor. I'll find it all. I'm a passionate woman. Goodbye, my boy. Goodbye, Maud. Be well. All right. Start your turd. Now, is that actually the end of those missions? I doubt it. Oh, yeah. It's going to take a... Uh... No, nah. I, I enjoy driving more than waiting for a taxi. Even if it is 2.5 miles. Got a much faster vehicle now. Top of the food chain. Oh, the speed. Where did you go? Guess it's coyote for dinner. <laughs> well, this car handles like ass on dirt roads. I mean, it makes sense because it's a sports car. Doesn't mean I can't be disappointed. I also still think it's faster than the dirt bike. Even on these dirt roads. That is a successful jump. American welcome. Oh, it's you. What are you idiots up to, huh? Мы здесь защищаем честь Америки. Это предназначено судьбою. Гордая страна, которая может совершить геноцид и назвать это волею Божией. Bella can't speak two words of English, but he knows this is the best country. <laughs> Jesus. Hey, hey, what's that? The illegals ruining the place. Come on. Come on, let's go. Let's, let's go. Get in. Get in. Rachen. Okay then. You still got that stun gun? Oh, good man. Always prepared. Oh, oh, the depths old troll for five hundred bucks. 
You two are completely loco. Hip, you'll forgive my use of Spanish. You do know what that means, right? You spout all this hippie nonsense, but I know you're a patriot, Trevor. I can just tell by looking at you. Okay, get me a cloak so I can incapacitate him humanely. Alrighty then. <laughs> Body out to me go! <laughs> hey, Civil Border Patrol, keep your hands where I can see them. This is a citizen's arrest! Not you lunatics again! You could have killed me! Get in a vehicle now, sir! D guy, D guy! Okay, hold. <laughs> Move it. <laughs> You're in your set. Good work, boys. <laughs> now head it's for a the cement factory. factory. We got reports of more illegals working over there. Where are you taking me? This is a kidnapping! This is time for you to go home to Mexico, sir! What are you talking about? This is my home. I have my papers right here. Fake. Oh, yeah? Well, let me see that. Complete forgeries. Oops. You won't get away with this. I report you. <laughs> you want to report me? <laughs> Are you sure this old man's a threat to American freedom? Sure as I've ever been about anything. Jesus, you're a real fuckwit. How'd you get your hands on this patrol car? Uh, I'm a proud park ranger, my friend. A trained security professional enjoying his time off. Well, and Joseph here, uh, well, I ain't sure what he does for a living. You see, we're men. We don't talk about ourselves. We're two like-minded pro-Americans who met online, and that's all I need to know. Is there a stoplight I'm not seeing here? Go! <laughs> Border Patrol, nobody move! There, there on the bike. Step on it, Trevor. Well, now that's an admission of guilt if I oh. ever saw one. Probably cartel members or child molesters. Go, go, they're getting away. How would you Yeah, that was my fault. I thought you were gonna apprehend him on foot. We didn't do nothing. Well, now that's an admission of guilt if I ever saw one. Probably cartel members or child molesters. We'll come back for him. Don't let the other one get away. Got it. Beauty. Civil border patrol. Okay, okay. Let's go, buddy. You're coming with us. Yeah, yeah. Underlay, underlay. Come on, move. In the vehicle now. When I said move, or I will zap you again. I'm getting in, okay? Crazy assholes. <laughs> All right, fellas. Well, let's go back for the other one. We don't have enough room in this car. It's getting dumped into the back. They are getting dumped into the very back. What? Go car, go now. Okay. That was English. What? He does speak a little, a couple words of English. I think those three Very words. Good work, everyone. Thanks for the help, Trevor. That You're was three a words. Patriot. We'll take it from here. Exit the vehicular. Give me a second. I am going to the road. No, this parking Trevor, lot works. I'm not joking here. Get out. So wow. I'll just get left here. We made Uncle Sam proud today. <laughs> okay. Guess that's a mission accomplished then. Okay. Franklin. You have some stuff. I am interested in seeing what it is.
Where are you at? Hey, holla at me, y'all. Peace. Strip club. Got Lamar and we got question mark. What the hell is Lamar doing? New street race. Need a vehicle if we're going to be doing a street race. Brother Adrian. Hmm. Oh. Tonight. I think we're at the tonight. So we just need a nice car. What the fuck? Oh, me in the oh. We are going to win this race. Are you ready to lose? From Here we go! To this one random car I found on the on the road. Two of two. Oh no! Okay, we're good. Make sure you don't lose control again. You want to lose at the last second. All right, I think we're good. And this is Franklin's way to get some the money. We've got to have money. Got a mark on his head, he took some damage. And what I like 
Mars right there. So what the fuck is going on? Oh, it's Lester, not Lamar. It's me, dog. Where we at? We're at Enzo Benelli, mafia guy turned real estate developer. He's bullied his way onto half the building contracts in Los Santos. Extortion, murder, labor racketeering, you name it. There's not a construction worker in town earning a livable wage right now, and Gold Coast Development is about to go under. <laughs> and let me guess, you got a personal interest in Gold Coast, right? <laughs> Anyone think you'd done this before? Uh, according to Benelli's cell phone, he's at the construction site downtown. It's done. One small problem. My source squealed. Benelli's expecting a hit. Watch yourself and go equipped. You'll have a lot of muscle. Hmm. Sounds like we need to find our way to the gun store. We need a little bit of armor. Now, I do not remember what I was supposed to invest in. Too crazy with that, you hear? You know what? Let's find out real quick. Against us, the other market. No, I got no idea. And it's going, going back up. These, these hourly charts are completely inaccurate, and I am not a fan of that. Five hour high, five hour low. I'm always looking at it when it's down, for some reason. Oh well. This is, I guess this is also technically another way. Oh, barks. Another way we could earn some good money. But I am dumb and don't remember what he wanted. Who exactly we're killing. Oh, he's going up. Gotta fight my way to the rooftop then. This is a close sight, buddy. Get the fuck out of here. Okay. Hey, where do you think you're going? This is private. Man, I don't have a silencer on this thing? Damn. Any more you bitches wanna get in my way?
chase all you fools if I have to. He fell. How are they? They go up the uh, elevator. Hopefully they're not lying in wait at the top of this elevator. Cause boy, that would sure suck. Pop your head out. He's here. Get that pump. I ain't playing here. Where the fuck is Benel? Oh, the fucking pole. The fucking pole. Are you serious? Two times in a row. Shot looking brutal. All right, give me a second. Uh, good. Any more you bitches want to get in my way? He's here. Get that punk. Where's Enzo? Stop them. 
fuck is he? I'll blaze all you fools if I have to. Come on, get your head out, buddy. I don't think there's anybody covering you. It's a little over. Enzo's gonna have so much balls for this. There he is. Oh! I'm putting you out of business, motherfuckers. We got most of our health. Keep climbing. And it'd be much better job for Michael. Slow mo shooting. Fun. Oh shit, there he is. How is he not dead yet? Get me out of here. Alrighty then. Oh shit, there he is! Stab! Look at that motherfucker! It's a long way down! I don't know the mouse keyboard controls, but I am learning on the fly. There we go. Leave the area. Is there a parachute? Fuck yeah. You did target by any means necessary, you say? Well, he just so conveniently left multiple parachutes. I tried to jump. But he decided to do that. Oh shit, there he is! Oh really? Stay I thought. Here, I thought this would be nice and easy. We just jump off the fucking... Fucking building. Just had to make it difficult and I had to kill everybody again. Goodbye. I'm doing... Taken care of, but man, that shit went south. I know. We better let this simmer now. Way too much heat. Very nice work, Franklin. Franklin just being great assassin. Oh, hey, 
way, we just get 10k off the off the bat for it. Worthwhile job. Okay, so who is over here? I don't want to try that. But we need a off-road vehicle. Hopefully we can pick one up while we're around there. Find out for yourself. Find find out find out about yourself. Wait, is there any time you took control of your inner self? Are you willing to spare five minutes for a lifetime of fulfillment? Visit my divine within to receive a free actuality analysis. Become an active engineer of your destiny. Missing. Have you seen this webpage? Their cult website doesn't exist. Need cab. Give. Can I get a cab out to me? Stay where you are. I got a driver right around the corner. Appreciate it. I saw that. The subtitles missed a period. It's not only a JRPG localization thing. Come on, cabby, where are you at? See, this is why I don't like using the cab crap. And now the sunk cost fallacy is kicked in and Hello, who did? It's Amanda. Amanda DeSanta. We met at my house. Oh. Oh, yeah. Uh see where you at? Look, I know that you and my husband and, and Trevor Phillips are I don't know what the fuck you're up to, but I can make a pretty good guess. There's some weird things going on. Is he okay? I don't think okay is the right word. I don't think that He's taxi's alive. coming. We appreciate that. No, I don't want to speak to him. I just wanted to know he wasn't dead somewhere. Thanks. Don't tell him I called. I. Right. But look, he ain't doing too good without his family. Finally here. That took way too long. Painful. Now, just take me there. Now I need to get myself a vehicular. Oh, he can't drop me any farther forward. Okay. Really, I, I came all this way and they just dropped me off here. If I'm lucky, I can find an off-road vehicle. some vehicles and somebody getting pulled over off-road race everybody's driving hummers damn Oh, you don't provide our own vehicles. Sure. Give me the Eurobeat. First place.
Big Surfer Sissies. Why break when you can steer good? Would they be mad if I ran over people in the crowd? Or did they sign a waiver? It'd be, it'd be li like, the, it's like one of those uh, people at those incredibly ridiculous off-road rallies where they're driving super fast on the narrow trails. hundred dollar dues and we got off new off-road races okay so there are a bunch of off-road races that we can do this one is just a stock car race and you get a car as a reward i guess so where oh where is the new race also we have boat races Off-road bike race. Yeah, I circled the map twice. I have no idea where, where it is. Ooh. That car's better. No. We can't have that in this house. Flash doesn't reduce health. Okay, maybe if we waited a little bit longer, we could see the race. I still don't see the race. Inactive off-road. Okay, so it's there, but it's inactive. Maybe only at a certain time of day, like nighttime. I'm trying to remember what it's called. There's like a there's like an old subreddit. Pretty sure it's inactive. Where the purpose of it was like routes that people take that is like faster off of the normal like sidewalk, where they leave a a noticeable. a noticeable path in it in, in the grass because it doesn't grow because so many people walk there and killed it like something path but i can't remember what it's called if only somebody could tell me hello boy what's that to me stuck in the well a man is stuck in a tree <laughs> Risk assessment. 
Why do you would rather leave him there because he's a bit of a dick? <laughs> but you're doing your civic duty. <laughs> okay, shit, show me. It's a dog, dog man. Follow the dog. They had to despawn my car because it was in the way of the cutscene. I've officially lost my damn mind. What, boy? He just jumped out of a fucking helicopter. <laughs> His parachute fell to open? And now you kind of wish he's missed a tree. <laughs> but morality is a human construct and you are not hardwired to think that way? I can't believe I'm getting smart talked by a fucking dog. Say what? Wait, you talking about my kind of bitches or yours? <laughs> this shit is getting weird now, man. Man, you wasn't wrong. Look at this fool. Damn. Here, I'll help you get down. Hey, bro. <laughs> you mind giving me a hand here? Man, that's a cool ass dog you got, homie. What dog? That dog that saved your saved your ass, man. Dude, I have no idea what you're talking about right oh, now. Oh god, he's schizophrenic. The fuck. Hello. <laughs> when you got a moment. Here My bad, dog. <sighs> oh. Oh. Oh man, that was wild. <sighs> Woo! See, I'm not an adrenaline junkie. I'm a control junkie. Yeah, that parachuting is intense, man. And hey, if along the way I figure out what it means to be alive, well then, let's just make this a little spiritual and say I'm on a thought journey. <laughs> shit, nothing helps me think clearly like shitting myself while I'm heading towards a certain death, man. Then you're up for it. Not really, dog. Shit, I respect gravity. <laughs> oh, I knew you were a pussy. Come on. It's safe, I promise you. Safer than driving a car. The only way it's safer is if you drive a car on a fucking airplane. Come on! Let's go! What the fuck is going on? We're going we're going helicopter jumping now. Here comes my pilot! Let's next level this shit! Yo, Jeff! You wanna take a bit longer next time, dude? Fuck, I gotta learn how to say no. It's actually a video I saw recently, a person uh, going out of a helicopter. You take the left side, man. Like the like one of those like helicopter jumping videos. And the lady is just like trying to hold on to the edge. Like the the uh, instructor guy or whatever just like takes his hand takes her arm, pulls her pulls her hand away and just pushes her out of the plane. See her parachute deploy immediately. Press A to skip the journey. Well, it depends if there's dialogue. Or normal shit. Get on the same page, but strategize and synergize. You feel me? Like the double helix. Man, all I'm feeling is regret on a whole new level. Take the tampon out, bro. It's like riding a bike, except at 100 miles an hour head first towards the ground. You can't go wrong. Am I right, chap? Statistically, safer than having a wank. What the hell? Yeah, man, it can totally get infections. You know, if you leave it too long between washes and 
<laughs> Take a damn shower. Seems like we hit, we hit the end of the dialogue, but I think we're about done. Wow, we can see the Earth's curvature. They made sure to confirm that the world isn't flat. Wait and see if he says anything else. Come on. You only got one move, my friend. This is happening. <laughs> There's only one way to go from here. Down. This the sky, dude. Oh shit. landing get on a bike why are you riding bikes man you are just slow my guy You're the one who's slow. Target's supposed to be all crazy. Skydiver. Okay, last one down the mountain buys the protein shake. Can't activate my thingy. Rubber bands. Go aggro on the track. Get right up in its grill. Relax session. Shit! Even bigger jump.
<laughs> Hit a random hiker. Alliance is getting kind of annoying. This guy should just quiet. This bike costs five figures. Man, you overpaid for this bike. Doesn't even have a motor on it. We just keep the bike. Contact Dom. Parachuting is now available. Hmm. Franklin's mission is right over there, so I'm thinking we check it out. Let's ride our bike over. Hijack a boat. Now, is it guarded? Now you see, if we walked off this cliff, we wouldn't be able to make it. But if we ride... Exercising demons, Franklin. But nice. Oh, this isn't the boat. You going for a swim? Wouldn't you care? I think I got a fat ass and I only swim because I float easily. I was just making conversation. Doing a three-way. A what? A triathlon. <laughs> Sounds like you got way too much time on your hands. F you. You like a stay-at-home cheerleader, do you? Pathetic. You know what? F you, bitch. I'll beat you. Come on. I promise. <laughs> I bet you like to beat women. I wonder why your ass is sink. Perfect beach start. I got this locked in. Come on! Shit, you need a vacation or something, lady. Admit it! You were herping my ass on the beach! Are you for real? Pick up the pace. I really ain't dressed for this shit. I don't even know what Franklin's stamina is at. 
turns pretty good though. Damn, that's cold. Don't be a baby. Mommy's not here. I'm your mama now. What are you doing, Marianne? Focus. Focus. Be one, baby. Here we go. Yeah, she's insane. A little, a little too, a little too nutty. Wonder what her deal is exactly, or if she's just nuts. A ramp, it's part of it. Alrighty then. What kind of triathlon is this? You already got beaten by Michael once. Not with you. Balance. Push through the burn. Use it. Take it, your bitch. I'm trying. Not you, idiot. Me. Now this is where the shoes become a benefit. Because it would definitely not help you in swimming. Hey, have you seen a dog anywhere? Yeah! It went down the beach, I think! Fire mile. Well, great, you won! Aren't you gonna gloat? Look, we both survived. These things are about taking part, not winning, right? No, Rand, it's always about winning. All right, we gotta keep going. I'm a loser. That unmarried, career-driven loser. Hey, girl, you better chill the fuck out. Go to hell. Why did he get his number? <laughs> Didn't even leave me a bike. Now, what are you doing? You can hang out the uh, the hangar. The Mexicans need guns, and someone's got to get it to them. Who the hell are you? I've seen some fucked up things, and you're one of them. Okay. That was... Unusual. Oh, we got another Minutemen thing. Might as well. Oh, that's a lot of parachute. Well, they leave the map as we do that. I'm sending one out right now. I'll be here. Hmm. 
All right, so let's kick back and relax. I mean, what else are we doing here? Oh, there's the cap. That was fast. Polito Bay. This is the spot, right? I've got something to say to you, asshole. Hey. Hey. I thought they deported you. Why do you care? Well, I don't. Except that they paid me some money. That must feel good. What a proud patriot you are. So, when are they kicking you out? They Minuteman Blues is the mission. Stupid, man. Why not? My family has been here 200 years. I'm more American than you. Not that there's anything to boast about. Oh, I'm sorry. Well, at least you got paid. No, don't get all serious, okay? Anybody can make a mistake. Perhaps now you want to kill me. Yeah, maybe, old man. Maybe not. You and your civil border patrol friends. You're all the same. Ignorant fools trying to protect something that's not even there. They're not my friends. Spend enough time with them. Yeah, I spend a lot of time with fucking people I don't like, all right? It's one of my favorite hobbies. Civil Border Patrol, man. Fuck you! You wanna fucking die? You don't scare me. You owe my family a great debt. What? Our land is no longer safe. It's not my fault. You're so concerned. Clean it up for me. Your choice. And no, I will not give you one cent. What? Last I heard, your civil border patrol friends were bullying some people east of here at the Sancudo farm. Go left on Ocean Highway, yep. you'll see them. This and there's somebody else you can go and oppress. <laughs> you know, I, I, I had a feeling you know that we were going to end up killing them oh, in the end. Fucking civil border patrol! The fucking black saber. So I guess we'll say hi and then just hop hop. Shoot first, ask questions later, huh? Removed from the jeep. Stay out of this, you dumb Canadian. Oh, you just made this real easy for me. Uh -huh. Now this is intense. Run. Run! <laughs> oh, I am so sorry. I want you... Civil Border Patrol disbanded. Whoa. Damn, that's a good car. I wanted that. So was that. Let's do parachuting. I'm very curious at like what exactly it entails and if we get something out of it. Or if we can only do it once and then it disappears from the map. I 
I am not dealing with a fucking attack dog. No. Oh look, faster travel. Very tough wooden barricades. Can I make it? Some YouTube poop mixing. Mountain. What do you say? Sure, let's parachute. It's like a pseudo fast travel system. This the decline. Superman 64 again, let's go. Somebody on the dev team really loved that game. We get money for going through the rings? Okay. get points for landing within the target zone? <laughs> right on its neck. Okay, it gets remarked on the map. Thread the needle. Yeah! Okay, where am I going? Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, military equipment. Okay, I think we're gonna need to get we're gonna need another taxi here. I feel like driving four miles. Get to a main road and call one. Okay, what's this? Well, that went off the rails fast. All that for like 5,000 buckaroos.
actually is a path over here. There we go. Now I can properly get my taxi. Have so many numbers now. One of your finest taxi cabs, please. Stay where you are. I got a driver right around the corner. That'll work. Be quick about it. This is not very quick. Oh, there he is. One destination. Hey, we're here. God damn it, it's a moving waypoint. Okay. No! You're getting wrong. Didn't realize that. Going down this road, so it's probably the best way to figure it out. Let's put a marker here to future proof it. Fuck. One briefcase, two briefcase. All right. Money well earned. Chopper is going to be a pain to lose. They are patrolling the dirt roads. swap to somebody else. I lost a wheel. Man, every 
vehicle here is a cop car. Now, if we could get a cop car, that would actually help us. Over. Or we could take their beetle car. Off roadie type vehicle. This hopefully will be effective. Much faster than the other one we had. And we also lost the helicopter. Oh, look at that drift. Solid Tokyo drift style. This is supposed to be an off-road vehicle. Why is it such a garbage off-road vehicle? Wait a minute, what the hell is that? Spaceship parts. Oh. Okay. Hoping if we just chill around here. We'll get... It's so hard to just get 10k. Military grade weapons are somewhere else still, too. back this way. So is it just like in an armored car or what? Woo! Venison steaks all around.
Fuck off. There we go. Mission complete. Should just call for backup. Now to deliver the goods to the meth lab. <laughs> Quick drive down the main road. I blew out a tire. Yeah, I blew out a tire. Oh well. Vehicle's functional. That's all that matters. Man, speed limit signs every few feet. That is not realistic to the real world. Hi. Hard work get. Ooh, even left Lester a nice car for me. The molester, bro. We got ourselves some military hardware. It's parked out back in my office. All right, we might be ready to move on this thing. Meet me up in the lab. Okay, this seems like a fantastic closer. Let's do the shit. Go, go into go into the back. You know it's faster than going to that going to the other side of that fence. All types of characters there. Back to you, follow. Hey, that's really this. There we go. Quick route to the upper floor. It's 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 not inappropriate! It's, it's another one of your fucking disasters. That's what it is. First you take a hostage against my advice, and then you start some kind of crazy high school romance with her. Are you nuts? She's she's a 60-year-old housewife. Ah, she's 57. <laughs> and she thinks that I'm mature. Yeah, well, let me tell you something. 30 years of marriage to the world's angriest mob boss ah. would make anyone insane. You're not making my situation any easier. Oh, there's a surprise. I knew it would become about you. I miss my family. Oh, you're full of shit. All you ever did was ignore them. And now that they're gone, you miss them. Fucking incredible. I'll tell you what's incredible. Fucking incredible. Hey. You mother... Hey, why? Enough. You got me out here. You wrote me into your crazy world of bullshit. <laughs> if it was lies, new age shit, and arguments about how good life used to be, I could have stayed my ass in Los Santos. Hello, Franklin. What's up? All right. Here's the shot. We're going to Palato Bay. We're going to do this thing. Any questions? Comments? Yeah. I miss Brad. If that crazy motherfucker was with us now, he would have loved this. Instead, he's got to enjoy himself molesting white-collar criminals in a federal penitentiary. Thanks for sharing. Anybody He's going to find out that Brad is dead and go completely psycho, me? isn't he? He'll be waiting for them by the river, handling the getaway. All right. Now, these three go in. They grab the tape. They rendezvous with you, and you get out of there. Does that uh, work for everyone? 
Great. Let's go. Let's get this done. Polito Bay. Ah, uh, yes. The white van. You ever hit a bank before, Franklin? Yeah, I was the driver on the job my boy Lamar fooled. Guess it's the same kind of shit we doing now, right? Nice, bro. What was the take? Shit, I don't know, man. I can't remember. Obviously it wasn't God. enough. Everyone remembers their first score. Uh, shit, not me. Huh? Mikey, bro, what was your first bank score? 88, outskirts of Carcer City. Took a small franchise for 10G. Yeah, things were easier back then. Yeah, 25 years ago. Jesus! Jeff, will you tell these gentlemen about your first yep. job? T, man. You could just as easily. You tell them. I'll do a sanity check. Trevor, the ultimate judge of sanity. I'd bring the friends well, along. It was uh, part of the interview process, I guess is how you'd call it. Trevor knew I could cook. Wanted to see if I could handle myself. This cash for gold guy comes through town. Stood the reason he had funds. Next thing we're burying him and his bodyguard in the junkyard. Well, most of them anyhow. 50K. He did fine. He's better at all aspects of the job now, from killing to dismemberment. Oh, shit. Your turn to share, kid. I told you I don't remember the details, man. Leave him alone, Trevor. This is an important moment, Michael. Here we are, on our way to almost certain death, bonding, pouring our hearts out, and this guy is sitting here, soaking it up and giving nothing in return. Hey, if he don't remember... If he don't remember? I'm supposed to trust this man with my life, and he don't trust me with the details of his first bank job? Well, how about you? Why don't you share with the group? I'm here. I'll back the facts. The check's cash place. I went in, took him for eight grand, walked out. Ha. <laughs> it was a bit more complicated than that, though, wasn't it, T? Maybe I knew the guy. Maybe he ID'd me. Maybe you did six months. Maybe I was out in four, and that, children, is why we don't leave witnesses. <laughs> that, children, is why you don't rob people that you know. Ha <laughs> ha! Yeah, Franklin, share. Yeah, come on, kid. It can't be worse than Trevor's. All right, man. Shit. Okay. The score was like two stacks, man. Two G. Take home on your first gig. Fuck, that ain't bad, man. Man, the whole score was two stack. Only I didn't see none of that shit. Dive pack went off, homie. Money was <laughs> useless then. Dive pack. <laughs> you amateur. I knew I shouldn't have told you shit. Hey, Franklin, we all gotta start somewhere. Last time I tell your ass something. Ow, come on. <laughs> Don't be so cold, man. Learn to laugh at yourself. You're in danger of turning into this man. Who, me? Yeah, you. Wouldn't laugh, wouldn't hang out. Uh, I've got my work, I've got my life. Uh, and never the truth shall meet. Uh, uh. If we're risking our asses, we gotta be family. How about that, die back? Man, fuck you. Sense of humor. Hey, let's just do this thing, all right? All right, Frank, we're gonna drop you up here, okay? When you hear it kick off, get ready because we're gonna want to go ASAP. I'm gonna get away, man. I'll do it. Breaking all the traffic laws makes it super subtle. All right, you know where you gotta be? I got it down. I'll bring a die pack just for you. <laughs> Reminds me of a of, a, of another thing I saw. People we were talking this? about. Uh, uh, I could use a restroom break and risk getting ID'd. You're an idiot. Talking about. All right, we all good. How people got Watch their out. call signs. And uh. Like pilots, pilot training for the military. Is this happening? It's always like something stupid that they did, we want a few or something. Time. Get just, out. Yeah, just dumb. One of two ways, friend. Everyone on the floor now. You and you out from behind the counter. That's it. Hands in the air. M. 
Keep an eye on our trusted employee. Okay. On the floor. You got the crowd. Cops should be here soon, so keep an eye out. I think the door is ready. Get over Stay here down. and kick it in, Em. <laughs> yeah. Time to meet this alarm guy. Fucking shoot him. <laughs> I'll get to him first. Yeah. Stay back! We got hostages! Tell the sheriff the 211 is confirmed. We're gonna need everything we got down here. <laughs> Sheriff's here. We never could have beaten that response. There's other ways of beating it. I don't care if they surrender. I'm killing me some bad guys. Now let the ready action movie out. <laughs> Sweet mother shit. That's the military hardware. I'm picking the minigun, fuck that. And the switched. Military heli? Are going to be flipping the tank? I'm sorry. 
I, I, I dig this. This is creative. Stuck on the fence, because of course I did. Time to take that slow ride again. I'm on my way. Hey, here we go. You okay? I ain't dead yet. I'm on my way. This is, this is fan-fucking-tastic, isn't it? Back to the beginning. Hey, you fools really been making a fucking mess out here. So what exactly is the minus on the tape? There we go.
work on your aim. Missing a guy. That tank don't look too friendly. Let's go inside the group. You shot old man, huh? I'm group just fine. Man, y'all look hot in the motherfucking new suits. The platform, let's go. Holy Jesus! They're all over us. Hold them down! Use me as cover, Frank. You don't want to get out front. I'm starting to feel under dress, dog. Stay behind me, kid. I got the armor. If I'd known you'd be this annoyed. Hey, man, these guys are every fucking weird. How you doing back there, Frank? They got as many people as the game is willing to throw at us. What about uh, Shep? How's he doing? Let's go. Yo, easy, easy. I'm a friendly. Agent Sanchez. Our very own corrupt G-man in training. You gotta be careful, buddy, all right? Because they are uh, looking around these trains for illegals. And if you're mistaken, you'll be shot, amigo. Very amusing. Yeah, if you're expecting them two to bring you up, you're gonna be disappointed, homie. Right back at you. Got the money? Everything we got. Okay, here's your cut. Considering present scrutiny on public worker remuneration, this is a big win. Oh yeah, it's a huge fucking win. Woo! Monsters. I'm out. Agent Haynes will get in touch with you once Operation Save the World to go. Got your crew together, okay? All right, we should probably split up. They're gonna be looking for a three. Oh, the blood we spill for the security of this country. Come on, Franklin. Man, I'll holler at you home. All right. Come on. Up. Serious? <laughs> <laughs> so, 
Small town, big job. Made a big impression at the Polito Bay Chicken Festival. That's a pretty big payout. I like. Let's cut right to them. Back to fucking civilization. And how about Trevor? In the middle of the water? Why? That is way of, uh, getting away. Pure curiosity, what has he got? What's in the pipeline? D? Dom. Which one was Dom? Was Dom the parachute guy or was he the car guy? And he got his... Hang on. Got... Cut off that. Got text messages. Meet me at the airport on some crazy shit to do and how. Cars are for pussies bike race this evening at this 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 Pus Fuki canals. We need a motorcycle that isn't shit though. Okay, let's just go with Michael. I lost my vehicle, but we're good. Perfectly ideal. What a fun way to end it. The big heist missions definitely seem like the most fun stuff. Your last search was concerning. I think we should have another chat. Call me. One o'clock in the morning. All right. Therapy. Doc. Then we'll end it. It's me. Michael. Que pasa, amigo? Not good. Things have been pretty fucked up. You seem particularly confused, Mikey. Tell me why. <sighs> Things are bad, Doc. Really bad. Tell me all about it. Sharing is winning. I'm out in the desert now, Doc. My wife left me, my kids. Oh, Christ. We upset some guy, but that wasn't enough. We stole his wife. Now we gotta leave town. I'm living in a trailer with my psycho old buddy Trevor. He keeps killing people, Doc. I mean, you know, shit, me too, but... Ah, oh, Christ, things are just really fucked up again. You've gotta make more time for therapy, Michael. This is a major relapse. Have you acted out in any other ways? Oh, yeah, the fucking works. I've done a lot of bad fucking things, Doc. And there's hardly a mortal sin that I ain't committed, all right? I wish you were always this honest, buddy. It's a vital part of recovery. That buddy felt loaded. I really I'll just want to be happy, Doc. That's so bad? Okay, okay. Anything else? What about sex, Michael? Look, I made a few mistakes, Doc. Pretty bad ones, but in the last few days... A lot better. Well, I suppose you seeing the problems you cause is progress of a sort. So, hey, you know, as you can see, I'm kind of doing better. You know, not perfect, mind you, but better. The thing is, Michael, <laughs> you know me. I'm not a sugar coder or a script writer. I mean, we tried a full range of pharmaceutical solutions a couple of years ago, and that went nowhere we want to go back to. Agreed? Agreed. <laughs> I ain't doing that again. Pissing myself, crying, sleeping in dinner, howling in the middle of the night. Fuck that shit. Mm -hmm. Maybe we got the doses a little wrong. You're going to have to get yourself under control. Listen, next time we meet, perhaps we should meet back at my office. But uh, 
I'm sorry. I'm afraid face-to-face -face sessions have got a little more expensive. Of course they have. Phone sessions were more expensive. Well, they were, but I realized that wasn't fair, so I raised the price on face-to-face. -face. I'm sure you <laughs> understand. And if you don't, maybe you should. Be well. Yeah, that's funny. I like that. Well, you should know I have feelings for Patricia. You'll deal with Madrazo one way or another. Our love is the beautiful flower that grows out the shit. Are you drunk? Alright, for real this time. There we go. Saved over it. All right, somewhere around halfway through, it looks like. So, we'll continue this later. Until then, have a good night.